Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an updated election map according to product538.com. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and subscribe for more videos. And I've got to say that my wife's hair looks like a freaking raccoon on the top of her head. And we have the election results according to the website that she named. Updated November 3rd, 2024 at 5 12 p.m. in the afternoon. So let's fill in that beautiful election map according to Project 538 with the Swiper No Swiping Fox. As always, we have the blue states for Kamala Harris, states that she is most likely going to win. They are Washington, Oregon, California, Hawaii, Colorado, New Mexico, Minnesota, parts of Nebraska, Illinois, New York, Virginia, New Hampshire, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Massachusetts, Delaware, Rhode Island, Maryland, D.C., and Maine at large. And the Reds, as we always have it, are the states that Donald J. Trump is most likely going to win. They are Montana, Wyoming, Idaho, Utah, Alaska, North Dakota, South Dakota, most of Nebraska, Kansas, Oklahoma, Texas, Arkansas, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, Missouri, Iowa, Tennessee, Florida, South Carolina, Kentucky, West Virginia, Ohio, Indiana, and the second district of Maine. We have the seven battlegrounds slash swing states that will determine the 2024 election. Currently, Kamala Harris has 226 electoral votes to Donald J. Trump's 219. Let's fill in this map according to this beautiful polling website. They have Nevada with six electoral votes as even. There is no clear winner in Nevada according to Project 538. Arizona with 11 electoral votes according to Project 538. Arizona is plus three for Donald J. Trump. Next up we have Wisconsin. According to Project 538, Kamala Harris leads in Wisconsin by one point, making it blue for Kamala Harris. Michigan, according to Project 538, it's 15 electoral votes, has Kamala Harris leading at plus one in Michigan, making it blue for Kamala Harris. Georgia with 16 electoral votes. Project 538 has one point in the lead for Donald J. Trump, making Georgia red for Donald J. Trump. North Carolina with 16 electoral votes, according to Project 538, has Trump in the lead by one point, making North Carolina red for Donald J. Trump. Last and least of all, according to Project 538. Has Pennsylvania and its 19 electoral votes as tied. It will not be colored in. This is quite the predicament, ladies and gentlemen, because neither candidate would win with Nevada. One candidate will win thanks to Pennsylvania. Will they find ballots and suitcases filled with ballots under a table once again, telling all Republican poll watchers to go the hell home while the Democrat poll watchers stay and rescan in the same ballots four, five, and six times in the 3 a.m. surprise? Or will this election be secure? And one of them will come out on top. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Who do you think is going to win? Nevada. But most importantly, who do you think is going to win? Pennsylvania. And if you are living in Pennsylvania, who are you voting for? I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And she is out in.